Hello friend, welcome back to another video from English Excel. In today's video, I will talk about HPLC calibration parameters. Friends, if you are regularly working on HPLC, then you must know what parameters are used to calibrate the HPLC system. So let's begin. Friends, before starting the video, I want to tell you why HPLC calibration is done. The answer is to check the accuracy of the system HPLC calibration is done. Friends, HPLC calibration parameters are basically four types. Number one, pump calibration parameter. Number two, auto sampler calibration parameter. Number three, detector calibration parameter. And number four is column oven calibration parameter. Number one is pump calibration parameters. It includes number one gradient proportioning valve GPV accuracy test and number two is flow rate accuracy. Next is auto sampler calibration parameters. It includes number one injector precision, number two injector linearity, number three carryover test, number four sample cooler temperature verification and number 5 is injection volume accuracy. Next is detector calibration parameters. It includes number 1 wavelength accuracy. In wavelength accuracy, check the maxima at 200 to 210 nanometer, at 264 to 280 nanometer and at 239 to 249 nanometer. Number 2 is detector linearity and number third is noise and drift and the last one is column oven calibration parameters in column oven calibration set the temperature 15 degree centigrade 35 degree centigrade and 80 degree centigrade and record the observation the column temperature must be plus minus 1 degree centigrade of the set temperature 